Hello, welcome to Linda Likes Tarot. Hi, my name is Linda. If you're new, welcome. If you're returning, what's up? I'm glad that you're back. Okay, so today this reading is going to be for whoever it's meant to be for. This is a general reading. Please be your own leader of discernment while watching this video. Okay? Okay, don't forget to hit the like button and the subscribe button. It I greatly appreciate it and it does help out the channel. All right, all right, all right, all right. Thank you for all your guys' um, super chats and your guys' donations. Um, it always warms my heart. It does. Let me turn this up a little bit. Okay. All right. So, um, first off, I've been doing personal readings today and similar cards have been popping out. So I feel like this is a collective thing. Um, this moon card keeps popping out. And this Neptune card keeps popping out. So there's something here that I feel like collectively, okay, that, um, that, that the collective needs to let go of, okay? This can be a person, place, or thing. Ooh. That the collective needs to let go of or sacrifice or something here. Or compromise with. I think it's... I'm getting something about the, um, the word let go. Something, something needs to be let go. Okay. In order to set yourself free from something. The Boshka is acting wild, so. Ay, 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 baba. Okay. All right. Also, be careful about how you react to things emotionally, okay? Or there's someone here that wants to get some sort of emotional reaction out of you, okay, guys? Um, this has been a running theme. Somebody wants your energy. So just be mindful of that. All right. Try not to give them what they want. Let's see what else. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. What's going on here? I'm also getting something about duality. Okay. Because there's there's two faces on here. So you guys could be dealing with a Pisces, a Libra, or a Gemini. Or this is your sign. Also, I've been seeing the number 69 a lot. Don't be gross. Um, but no, really, the number 69 could be significant for someone. Um, 69 is also like the symbol of like cancer. So I could be talking to a cancer. You could have cancer anywhere in your chart, sun, moon, rising, Venus, north, north, south node. Um, if you do this message is for you, um, or you could be dealing with a cancer. All right. All right. Or somebody could have cancer. That's for some of you, not all y'all. Okay. Um, but I have been seeing a lot of hearses, like while I'm out driving, um, like on the road, there's like hearses. I hope I'm making, I hope I'm saying that right. Those black vehicles and they, whatever. Okay. So something here about your 12th house is significant. Something here about, um, a test of faith. You're being tested here. Something here about a spiritual test. All right. This could be something that's coming up or something that you're in right now. This spiritual test is going to be putting like um, pressure when it comes to your emotions. So there's something here about making a, a, something about your heart space. Some sort of decision that you have to make. I feel like for a lot of you, you don't want to make this decision because it's something that it could be um, very, a very, this could be something that you're very emotionally attached to. Okay. Or there's something here that's very overwhelming. Whatever this decision is. All right. It could be in the matters of love. Don't have to be. But something like that is going on. Bosh, come on now. Oh my god. What are you doing? This cat. Okay, Baba. Come on. Come on now. <sighs> what else do they need to hear, Spirit, regarding this situation? What else do they need to hear regarding this situation? Yeah, there's somebody here that wants to come in and confront you or uh, have a face-to-face -face conversation with you. You guys could be dealing with a Libra or a Taurus, or I'm talking to a Libra or a Taurus. Um, someone here could also be a fire sign, an Aries, a Leo, Sagittarius, okay? There's someone here that's definitely going to be taking action here towards you, all right? There's someone here that's really... Um, whoever I'm speaking to, whoever's watching this, you are very attractive right now. Like, you're attracting a lot of good things into your life, okay? <clears throat> Jesus. You guys could be dealing with an Aquarius, or I'm talking to an Aquarius, okay? You're also being asked to hold on to your vision at this time, okay? We have Sagittarius, all right? 
I could be talking to a Sagittarius or you could have Sagittarius somewhere in your chart. I'm also getting like there's somebody here that um, wants to know what's going on with you. There's someone here that might want to check up on you. You might be um, you might get a phone call or a text from somebody here or an email or something like that. Some form of, of communication is going to be coming in towards you. OK, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, tell me more. Yeah, we got Aries. I could be talking to an Aries. You could have Aries somewhere in your chart or you're dealing with one place where it needs to go. We have Scorpio. I could be talking to a Scorpio. You could have Scorpio somewhere in your chart or you're dealing with one. Um, there's something here about a shapeshifter for sure. So you could be dealing with someone who's very manipulative. Why does this all happen? Right when I'm in the groove. Okay, give me a second. Right when I'm in the groove. Okay, there we go. Someone wants to start something over. Interesting. Okay, so how this song, it played all the way through, right? And then a new song played. And then I came in, confirmation. And I came in and I switched the song back so that it could repeat on cycle. There, um, Someone here wants you to go back into a cycle with them. Someone doesn't want you to go on to the next song. Um, we have Pisces. You could be dealing with a Pisces or you could have Pisces somewhere in your chart. Okay, tell me more. All right, you could be dealing with a Gemini. I could be talking to a Gemini. You could have Gemini somewhere in your chart. One more for me. Please, spirit. Oh, one more. Who else can they be? Who else could be involved in this situation? Cancer wanted to come out. Cancer, okay. So you guys could be dealing with a Cancer. You could have Cancer somewhere in your chart or you're dealing with one. We got Capricorn. You could be dealing with a Capricorn. You could have Capricorn somewhere in your chart or you're dealing with one. And then we have Libra at the bottom of the deck. I feel like this has to do a lot with um, relationships here. It doesn't have to be romantic. This could be relationships with family, friends, um, or just people in general. Okay, how you handle relationships or what you will or will not accept when it comes to some sort of relationships. When it comes to people. <sighs> Sorry, my mouth. I feel like my brain can't catch up with my mouth. Okay. Let's see what's going on. What else do they need to hear regarding this situation? You're also being asked to truly focus on your goals right now. Okay. Yeah. We have third eye chakra truth. Whoever I'm speaking to, your third eye is popping, just like this pimple is on my goddamn forehead. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Um, your third eye is popping. All right. You see the truth. Someone here could be born on the 26th. Don't have to be. Okay. I'm also getting something about the number eight is very significant for someone. You guys could be seeing a lot of eights. So you guys could be seeing eight eight eight. Okay. Six 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 nine 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 four 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 one four four. 111 1111 for show. Um, but there's some sort of truth here. I feel like there's truth that you already intuitively know, right? And then there's going to be physical truth being shown to you for some of y'all or for a lot of y'all. Or someone here is intuitively seeing through um, a Libra or a Libra, your third eye is popping. Place it where I need to go. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can't tell me what else is going on here. I'm also get, I'm hearing Lady Justice. I don't know. Lady Justice is blind. Someone here is going to be receiving like some sort of um you're going to be receiving your justice, but someone here someone feels like your justice is unwarranted or I don't know. Yeah, someone's going to jail. We got trapped in fear. Someone here is getting locked up in spiritual jail or physical jail. We have obstacles and challenges at the bottom of the deck. There's someone here who was definitely putting a lot of, um, making your life difficult, basically. Someone here was really trying to make your life difficult in the physical and in the spiritual or both. Tell me more. Tell me more. Tell me more. Da -da 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 -da. Tell me more. Tell me more. Something here about the 1950s is significant for some of you because i keep channeling greece the movie okay part of someone could own a poodle dog or something about poodle skirts um someone here could be a hairdresser someone could work on cars
Let me keep going. We have memories of love in reverse. Okay, so there's someone here that you do not have very... You don't have a lot of good memories with this person is what I feel like. Whoever this person is that's going to jail or um, is getting locked up. Okay, we have wisdom at the bottom of the deck, number five. So for whoever I'm speaking to, you could have known that this person... You intuitively already knew that this person here was doing something wrong. I'm also getting this person knew. They 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 knew they were doing something wrong. They went against their better judgment with this wisdom card. Somebody knew what they were supposed to do, but they decided not to do what they were supposed to do. Someone here could be born in 1986 or 85. Okay. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can you tell me more? I'm also getting like someone's having like negative memories about what they've done to you as well. Yeah, whoever I'm speaking to, you definitely has stood your ground in some way against this person or you're going to need to in the future. You're going to need to stand your ground, stick to your beliefs, stick to your morals, stay focused on what you have um, planned for yourself. Whatever goals you have, stick to them because I feel like someone wants to come in and disrupt this, okay? Someone's area code could be 876 or 786 okay that's for some of you not all y'all yeah something about your third eye something about your intuition is popping baby third eye chakra okay i can see clearly now the rain is gone i can see all obstacles in my way so someone's path is going to be like visually something about your vision you're going to be able to see something so much clearly once this truth comes out or once the truth is revealed to you intuitively or in some form of download or just in the 3d in general Let me see. Oh my god, I mean, I'm I'm channeling like brr, I can't even talk. I'm channeling too many different songs in my brain right now. I'm hearing "Come on over, come on over, baby," and then I'm also hearing. Um, are you ready by the temptations? Someone's coming in. Someone's coming in. You got someone coming in. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. How's that song go? Hold on, hold on. Temptations. Maybe there's someone here coming in that's a temptation. Someone here is going to tempt you. Get ready, because here I come. This could be your spiritual test. It goes... I never met a girl who makes me feel the way that you do. It's all right. Whenever I, I'm asked to mix my dreams real, I say that you do. You're right in sight. <laughs> so fee fi fo fum look out, baby. What? Because here I come. I'm bringing you a love that's true, so get ready. So get ready. Okay, so maybe there's a true love coming your way, and then you got another person that's weird. We keep getting this fucking storyline. I'm gonna try to make you love me too. Um, see, that's the part I don't like. If you wanna play hide and seek with love, let me remind you, it's all right. But the loving you're gonna miss in the in the time it takes to find you, it's out of sight. <laughs> I'm so scared. Okay, I could take this song twice. I could take it two different ways, bro. <laughs> I don't know how to feel about this song. 
someone's trying to find you whoever this is this could be if this is a karmic a karmic's trying to find you from your past and make you love them or this is like your true love is trying to find you so that you could love them or they could love you or you have like i don't know the possibilities are endless holy spirit holy angels what the heck is going on why do we have um trapped up here spirit what the heck is going on yeah your ancestors here is whooping someone's ass we got we got we got ancestors here okay it says look for clues to your challenges and then it says and gifts in your family patterns family ascent as essential i can't even fucking do you hear me <laughs> i can't ancestral karma okay something about that is going on Someone is getting some sort of karma here in the spiritual because they done fucked it up, okay? Someone here got lost along their path and now they're in spiritual jail. You also need to know you're in the middle of, the, you're in the in-between, whoever I'm speaking to. You feel like you you have, you're, you could be feeling anxious and you don't fucking know why or you do know why, whatever it is. You feel anxious or you're on edge or you feel like things are eerie. It's because you're in the in-between, okay? It says, some steps can't be predicted. Allow life to show you the way. You're being asked to have fucking faith. This is a test of your faith. If you are feeling like I just described, like you're in, in the, you're like you're in the in-between and you don't know what's going to happen next, but you know something is going to happen next. You know there's some sort of change. You do know there's something positive coming, but you also feel like there could be something negative. There could be like, I don't know, whatever this is, you need to know, you need to have faith. This is a test of your faith. This is why you're not getting all the fucking answers because you don't, you're not supposed to, whoever I'm speaking to. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, tell me more. Yeah, the calling. Whoever I'm speaking to, you're being asked to answer the call. And whenever you're in this predicament to answer the call, your faith is heavily involved. Blind faith is heavily involved. Taking leaps of faith blindly is very is is what's required of you. Like I was saying, Lady Lady Justice is blind. I don't know something like that. Um, it says expect to receive the news that you've been patiently waiting on. Some sort of call, text, news, communication, info. All right. But this is from someone you don't have very good um, a very good rapport with or someone that you don't have like the best memories with. So this could be like a family member because we do have ancestors out here. So this could be a family member out here that's going to be calling you that you don't have a good relationship with. Um, but they're going to tell you some news that you need to hear. This news could be mind blowing. OK, it could even put you out of shock. It says in a trance, it says lost in a trance of emotions, feelings that you'll never forget. So there's could be some sort of truth that one of your family members are going to tell you about something. Maybe it's going to blow your goddamn mind. This is going to be a day you're never going to fucking forget. I will fucking know. That's what I'm getting. So get ready. Get ready. Do, 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 do. So get ready. Get ready. Because here I go. We got um the staff. It says, take stock of the situation before making a decision. It says, stand firm, spiritual power, wait. Okay? Someone might want to come in and, like, um, try to rush you to do something. You're being asked to wait. Or just stand firm on your fucking beliefs. Because someone here might come in and tell you, like, hey, why don't you do this and this? But you've been patiently waiting for something else. Something about a temptation. Just wait for what you're trying to wait for. Dang it. Yeah, because we said because right here it says all that glitters is at the bottom of the deck. So whatever someone here is gonna come in and try to make you do or make you do what you don't want to do or whatever this is. Um This is a good time to be fucking stubborn, whoever I'm speaking to. You know, people might talk a lot of shit about you being stubborn bitch this is the time you should be this is where this is where you fucking shine <laughs> right here standing your ground okay someone here could be born in 1978 uh, or 1987 flip it where need to go there's a lot of 80s babies out here um someone here could be 38 years old that i'm speaking to but we have don't be fooled by appearances is what what seems bad might turn out good look look deeper judging more information is needed so just be careful also don't be careful about misjudging something as well or someone so 
but stand your ground regardless of the situation wait before you take some sort of action here when it comes to someone please use your discernment you're being really asked to use your discernment here when it comes to partnerships okay and the matters of the freaking heart all right but whoever's coming in with this partnership this is someone who's destined to come in for you ciao okay This is someone that's good for your soul. This is your emperor. God damn. <laughs> Whoever I'm speaking to, your emperor's coming in. Man or woman, place where we need to go. Don't even matter. We got uh, victory and success is coming your way and rec recognition and reward. And this is all coming in because you decided to release the need to control some shit. And some truth is going to be coming out and things are being balanced for you. Ciao. Also, it's because some of, uh, whoever I'm speaking to, you spoke your truth. You stood up. You spoke your truth or when this situation happens and this person comes in and confronts you or whatever this is you got to speak your truth if it's not a yes it's a no holy spirit holy angels tell me more simple as that yeah whoever i'm speaking to you could be a shaman don't have to be but we got sh a shamanic 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 i can't even fucking talk drumming it says allow music to heal your soul and connect you to spirit okay says um expression music signs sound healing okay so some of you need to, s to listen to music to maybe help um help you tap a little deeper into some sort of answer that you need intuitively maybe you need to actually listen to music like on shuffle or something you might get an answer here okay or maybe if you've been feeling blah or if you've been feeling like not inspired to do shit or whatever, you need you need some music in your life. Someone here could be born in 1984. All right. Someone here could be a Hayoka um, empath. Don't have to be, but we do have this here. Okay. It says, don't avoid whatever is triggering you. It says, move through it and heal yourself. We have mirror, empath, triggers, need healing. So I feel like also whatever is coming in, whatever this mind-blowing information is when it comes to your, your family, I feel like whoever I'm speaking to, the family that is... Um, trapped in fear is a family that you don't have good memories with that you are distant from whatever they come in and tell you you might get fucking triggered you might get fucking pissed um don't just listen like it says move through it and heal yourself okay when it comes to the situation don't lash back out it's not worth it don't hit him with your staff <laughs> okay what else because justice is on its way someone could be mad because justice is on your side or something it don't matter it ain't it ain't it is what it is spirit tell me more what else do they need a horror god dang it we got community and then we have sudden wealth so whoever i'm speaking to your family might call you about some sort of uh sudden wealth that is owed to you someone might ask you to fuck it let me keep going why do we have um trapped in here someone might ask you for money that's what i was gonna say but i didn't say whatever i could be talking to a main male here there could be a main male here that might be going to jail that's in your family for doing something. Yeah, this is someone from your community, your family, your neighborhood, your city, um, something like that. Your local government. I don't fucking know. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, tell me more. Yeah, whoever I'm speaking to, you are a privileged lady or you about to be. I'm also getting there could be a mother figure in your family that you do not have good memories with or, you know, a, mo a mother figure. This, this person... Um, you're going to get a call or a text or you're going to get information about this person. Something like that. This could be about a home that could have been left to you. Okay. Or something here about this person's health. You're going to get some information about it. Maybe you're going to be getting some sort of bad news about someone, a mother figure's uh, health. Something like that. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. What do we have Sandra Brown? Ay, Dios mío. You the me. Um, yeah. Whatever this is, it's meant to be on your path. All right. What's this? Someone here is really heavily thinking about you. All right. You about to get some sort of great fortune here. I'm also getting your ancestors and angels. They really think of you highly. Okay. They feel like you're the one to carry on some sort of um, generational something. Wealth, probably. We got wealthy man. 
some of you could be a wealthy man or there's a wealthy man in your family that left you some money and you're going to be you're going to be uh, experiencing some sort of sudden wealth here this is something that was ruled in your favor in, during court or if you're having a court situation going on for some of you you about to come out a rich bitch we got despair someone here is in despair or will be in despair if you're in despair now you need to buck up buttercup okay we have poverty at the bottom of the deck someone here is going to be left out in the fucking cold i feel like there's someone here that might want to try to compromise with you when it comes to some sort of court court ruling outside of the courthouse listen stand your ground fuck this person sorry <laughs> let me calm down holy spirit holy angels what else do they need to hear listen i don't know about y'all i'm gonna be very transparent the last couple fucking uh days i've been experiencing um headaches and i've been fucking tired even though i'm sleeping i don't know if i'm the only one but um it like low-key feels like i don't know it feels weird i'll say that Oh, shit. Tell me more. I honestly feel like I'm picking up someone's, someone else's energy. So listen, okay, if you're feeling this way, this could be somebody here that um, has tried to bind themselves energetically to you. And this is what they're going through. Their health could be um, not the best. And you could be picking that shit up. Especially if you're a Hayoka. Okay, empath. Yeah, someone's shape-shifting. Interesting. Let me see. Why do we have trapped here? Get ready, cause here I come. What's this? We have fright. Someone here is frightened. They're depressed. They're paranoid. Um... They have a fear of someone's ancestors whooping their ass because it's already happening. <laughs> someone here could be born in 1962, don't have to be. Or someone here could be 62 years old. Whatever it is, someone here is frightened because they're realizing that you are really good at what you do or that you're a professional or someone um, messed with someone who um, outranked them is what I feel like is going on. Someone's, someone's scared now, they know this. Whoever this main male is. This doesn't have to be someone in your family, this main male. This could be somebody, um, like an ex of yours for some of you, okay, that is being visited by ancestors getting the ass whooped. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, that's for some of you, not all y'all. Tell me more. Yeah, it, whoever this main male was, they're getting in trouble or being put in jail for either planning a robbery, actually doing a robbery, or this could be physical or spiritual, okay? Someone here could have could be getting caught up for trying to steal something energetically or something physically from you, okay? Listen, this is not everyone's story. Something here was on a scheduled time. Someone fucking dropped the ball. Someone ran out of time here, okay? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, tell me more what the heck is going on. Someone here feels something is unfair as well. This is why they wanted to steal something from you. If this, is in, if this is talking about an inheritance or something about a court situation, someone felt like it was unfair that, um... They owed you something or they had to pay something or um, whatever. Someone got a problem. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, why do we have... Uh, da -da 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 -da, what is this? This one. Why do we have this? Thank you. Okay. Listen, you're being asked to walk away from someone. Okay. You're being asked to reject somebody here out of your life. <clears throat> Ay, ay, ay. Someone here is definitely awakening, though, to something here. You could be realizing that you gotta let something go here. I'm also getting like. Uh, there's a. Let me get going. Someone's blind. Okay, I feel like for some of you. Mm, whatever this information is coming in you are like purposely blinded from knowing this information but you're going to be awakened to this you're going to start realizing that who was really the person that you shouldn't have you shouldn't really trust or, or um who your enemy is there's like a hidden enemy that's going to be revealed to you you guys could be seeing the number nine a lot <sighs> you 
whoever I'm speaking to, you're you're going towards your destination. You're going towards your purpose. Or someone's goal or purpose was to keep you blind. But I feel like that's not happening no more. There's also like a third person a third party situation involved in someone's situation. This could be a romantic relationship, business relationship, family, whatever, friends, a third party involved in this that you're going to find out was involved in something. I don't know. Let me keep going. Stand around. Yeah, someone here is wearing a lot of fucking masks. Someone here is trying to get the fuck out of jail. Someone could be fantasizing while they're in jail trying to figure out how to get out of jail. Someone here could have schizophrenia. Or they have multiple personality disorder. I don't know. Something like that. You need to stand your ground to get, uh, uh, against someone. Someone's a shapeshifter. Someone, someone's weird. Someone lives in a fantasy land, so they may not live in reality. This person's not playing with a full deck, whoever this individual is. Okay? This person's asking you to help them to be unfree. Maybe someone's asking you to help them get out of jail. I don't know. You might get a phone call that someone's in prison or in jail, whatever. Someone took the wrong advice. Someone took the wrong advice. Someone thought this advice was a good advice, good advice, and they're realizing it was bad advice. The blind leading the blind. There's going to be a lot of conflict here going on, or if there isn't already, okay? And this is a lesson being learned, or someone here is definitely going to learn a big lesson when it comes to whatever they, they got themselves involved in. Um, something about the number seven could be of significance, which reduces to the number nine. Or someone could be born in 1972. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, sorry. <laughs> Can you tell me more what the heck is going on? Yeah, whoever I'm speaking to, you about to have some luck, baby. You about to hit the jackpot. Someone here could be 32 years old, don't have to be, but someone's hitting the jackpot. Your intuition is going to be the key to you getting this luck here. Whoever I'm speaking to. And someone else, look look at this plurality, or no, I can't even talk. The duality of the situation. See how someone here is going to have a, a luck, have luck here, and someone else here is going to have some sort of failure or some sort of downhill situation. Someone's going to ask you for money. I feel like if this is involving a home and an inheritance, someone here might have to get out of some sort of home and give it to you because it's left to you. It's in your name. And that person may not have a place to live. They might try to ask you for a handout. It might they might try to come in with a bunch of different faces, like, oh, you could you could uh, I, <laughs> like someone's gonna come in and try to really compromise with you, but they're gonna slowly aggressively get crazy on you because you're gonna be standing your ground. You're gonna be you're gonna be firm in what you say and what you want, and this person's gonna lose their shit on you probably. I don't know. It doesn't matter. You're going to be fine, though. Just know that you're highly protected. Make sure you stay up when it comes to um, you keep up with your prayer game. Okay. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, tell me more. Yeah, something's destined to play out here. Someone here could be born on the 16th of a month. Someone going to prison, baby. I don't know. Someone going to jail. Someone getting locked up. Someone's, someone's, or someone here is uh, putting limits on themselves that they don't need to be. Or someone's blaming you for something that they did to you. Like someone's not willing to take accountability for some sort of actions that they've taken. Get out the tea real quick just to see what we got going on. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what the heck is going on here? What do we need to know about this situation? Ay, ay, ay. Whoever I'm speaking to, this Beyonce card keeps coming out. Whoever I'm speaking to, uh, you guys could be dealing with the Virgo, or you are a Virgo. Um, we got Queen Rising here. You're definitely shining bright, baby. You could be in the spotlight. You could have some sort of um, platform or 
um, I don't know, something here. Oh, by the way, speaking of platforms, all I, I am only on YouTube. Okay, somebody said that they saw one of my videos on Instagram. I am not on Instagram. I have an Instagram, but I have not posted anything on there. So if there's people posting shit on Instagram, it's not fucking me. Unless they're sharing my content. That's fine. Okay, let me just make that abundantly clear. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can you tell me more? Yeah, there's someone here <clears throat> who's constantly thinking about you. Who the hell is this person constantly thinking about my, my babies? Who's constantly thinking about them? This is a Gemini. So there's a Gemini here who's constantly thinking about you or someone here who has Gemini somewhere in their chart or I'm talking to a Gemini and this is something that's happening to you okay someone here could have the Chinese zodiac sign of the goat or you do note the date <laughs> someone here could be a Libra there could be a Libra that's thinking about you a lot or a Libra someone's thinking about you tell me more We got monkey. Someone here could have the Chinese zodiac sign of a monkey. Note the date. Okay. Someone here could be a Virgo. They could have Virgo somewhere in their chart. Or there's a Virgo here. Um, what was I saying? There's a Virgo here thinking about you. Or a Virgo, someone's thinking about you. Pisces, someone could be thinking about you. Or a Pisces thinking about you. Heavy. Okay. I keep hearing this song. Um, I don't know if I want to say it in this video. I might want to save it for another one. <laughs> Hopefully it will leave my brain. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, tell me more. <sighs> Someone here does not like that you pulled away your sexual energy from them. This could have been someone that you were just hooking up with. Or there's someone here that misses your sexual energy. For sure, that's for some of you, not all y'all. We have this in reverse. Yeah, someone here is in fear, okay? They're in fear that you'll never take them back or that you're going to reject them if they if they make a, a move towards you. Some of you, you might. <laughs> we, got, we got bankrupts. So someone here could be bankrupt or there's someone here that wants to bankrupt you of your power and your spotlight. So, um, I don't know. I'd be careful of this motherfucker. Tell me more, spirit. Yeah, whoever this person who's thinking about you has their head in the clouds. This person could also smoke a lot of weed or be under the influence a lot. Regardless of the situation, they don't have to be. But regardless of the situation, this person ain't shit. Whoever's thinking about you, they ain't shit. Okay. No offense, but that's what's going on. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, tell me more. This is how you feel, is what I feel like. We got ghosted. This could have been someone who ghosted you in the past, or this is someone that you ghosted. Because you were like, no, no thanks, I'm good. This could have been someone who didn't really want anything committal. They didn't want to commit. This could have been a very, like, a Netflix and chill type of person. Like, this could have been someone who didn't even want to take you out on a date outside. Okay, that's for some of you, not all y'all. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, tell me more. But now all of a sudden they see you in the spotlight and they want to be all on you. Yeah, this person is obsessive or this person is connected with an obsessive lover that they're trying to um, move away from. Or this is just a karmic obsessive lover that's trying to find you. Are you ready? Here I come. He's going to make you love him. Or she is going to make you love her. Flip it where it needs to go, chow. I don't like it. I'm also getting like, you're getting, someone tried to put you caught in the middle of something here and you didn't even realize. All right, someone here is starting to understand something here or understand you because maybe their third eye is fucking popping open. Um, someone here can't deal with the situation or they can't understand how you're in the spotlight or how you got yourself, how you healed yourself or how you got yourself in the position that you're in. Whatever. Um, what else do we need to her? Get ready, here I come. I'm also getting, there's something here about family drama. Okay, someone here could be 61 years old, don't have to be. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what the heck is going on here? What do they need to her? What do they need to her right now? Okay, we have shook. Someone here is shook. <clears throat> or you might get shook, place where it needs to go. It says they are acting unbothered. The truth is they are shaking. So there's someone here that is frightened. They are shaking. They are paranoid because they know what they have done. They know that karma is here to fucking um, 
whoop that ass we got 999 we got the end of a cycle is coming to an end someone knows that this cycle is ending and they don't know what to do with themselves i don't know we got overactive throat steady throwing shade and having your name in their mouth this is what this person be doing all day or day you guys could be seeing 1010 a lot because god knows i have 1010 it says you are surrounded by unconditional love you need to know this you need to remember this tell me more yeah you got a doppelganger out here that shook it says they dress or act like you because they want to be you so there's someone here that doesn't know themselves they don't love themselves they'd rather be someone else and that someone else is you okay we have cord cut it says it is time to release them cut them off um there's someone here that you need to sacrifice you need to let go dead ass okay i feel like for a lot of you you're still talking to this person we got next victim it says they will move on to the next person to bad mouth and become obsessed with so you have someone here who's obsessed with you but that doesn't mean it's love this is a temporary fixation they have on you holy spirit holy angels tell me more <clears throat> someone here is pressed 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 they can't stop thinking about you whoever this person is you already know this person ain't shit whoever i'm speaking to so there's someone here who's obsessed with trying to find you and wants to be with you and wants your sexual energy but yet at the same time this person's talking mad shit about you or they have in the past what's this we have fake opportunists this person just wants what you have or what you're you're going to receive it says watching over others or watching others to see what they can take to make it their own someone this is a taker coming in you got a taker coming in that's all we got and you got true love coming in though but this ain't this ain't it whatever this is this ain't it holy spirit holy angels who's this wannabe dolphin ganger dolphin dolphin something about dolphins um <clears throat> wannabe doppelganger who the fuck is this okay this is someone you haven't your doppelganger could be someone who's in your family or someone who's connected to your family or someone here that you had a past connection with okay this person could be a libra that's your doppelganger <laughs> or it could be a virgo that's a doppelganger or a libra virgo you guys have a doppelganger somewhere out here holy spirit holy angels mm. ciao <sighs> Who, who out here is steady throwing shade having their name in the collective's mouth can we get a zodiac sign okay someone here could be a have the chinese zodiac sign of an ox okay that's always having your name in their mouth or this is your sign or someone's sign place where it needs to go um a scorpio here could be talking shit or scorpio someone's talking shit about you maybe you feel it maybe your ears are ringing tell me more someone's talking shit because they don't want anybody to be in a new connection with you someone got a problem someone doesn't want you to find love they know that love is on uh its way to you they don't want a cycle between y'all to be over someone doesn't like that you're so distant from them or maybe you live at a distance from this person tell me more about this fucking person talking shit yeah this person that's always running their mouth okay this person could be a cancer or you're a cancer flip it where need to go but this person's a saggy we got sag at the bottom of the deck tell me more or you're a Sag, flip it where it needs to go, please. An Aries, there could be an Aries out here that's talking mad shit about you, okay? Flip it where it needs to go. Or Aries, someone's talking shit about you, flip it where it needs to go. There could be a Capricorn out here that's talking shit. Or this is a whole group of people that's talking shit together about you, okay? But at the same time, they want to mirror what you got going on. They want to copy what you got going on. These are haters and fans all at the same time, all right? So we got Scorpio. We got Cappy. We got Aries. We got Cancer. We got Saggy that was in here. Someone else, I forget. Okay. Who is fucking Shook? Who's Shook out here? Who is Shook? The number 44 could be, could be very significant for you. Who's Shook out here? This dog. You ain't nothing but a dog player. I get it. Fraud player. I get it. I understand. I understand. Yeah. You ain't a man. You ain't a man. Yeah. <laughs> Stop. This person gonna have the Chinese uh, zodiac sign of a dog, or you do. Flip it where you need to go. But someone here is shook. Shooketh. 
Is this someone that you could have known for a very long time? This person could have the Chinese zodiac sign of a goat. Or you do. Or a cancer is shook. Flip it where it needs to go. Or you have cancer somewhere in your freaking chart. We have been picking up cancer. I picked up cancer in the beginning of this reading. Something about a cancer. I'm talking to a cancer, baby. Or you got a cancer on your ass. Why do we got um fake opportunist who is this oh let me put this motherfucker right here speaking of which so i could just show you a visual the 69 okay holy spirit holy angels tell me more what the heck is going on here what do they need to her what do they need to her why do we got fake opportunists here someone's gonna come in and act like they're your soulmate they ain't okay this could be a feminine energy or i'm talking to a feminine energy that needs to be warned about somebody coming in okay saying like oh we're soulmates but this person's really just trying to come in and see what they could take from you all right <clears throat> someone here could have the chinese zodiac sign of a horse or you do flip it where you need to go baby boo all right yeah this is a false flame of yours that's coming in trying to act like they care all right they might want to even come in and offer you resources or shmoney a place to live whatever this is it ain't it ain't uh it ain't right <clears throat> whatever it is who pressed come on come on now someone's pressed about someone coming in nurturing and supporting you you may have already met someone new you could have already you could already be in some sort of new connection and someone doesn't like that you're getting some sort of they're witnessing this person nurture and support you like wholeheartedly someone does not like this this could be a gemini that you're with or this is a gemini that's pressed about something or a capricorn's pressed about you being with somebody else or capricorn Someone's pressed about you being with someone else. Flip it where you need to go, please. This is a collective reading. It's general. Who needs to get their cord cut? <laughs> Who needs to get their cord cut spirit? Pisces. Pisces, you need to cut your cords from somebody. There's someone here that's mirroring you, or there's a me or there's a Pisces here that's copying or mirroring someone. Flip it where it needs to go. Or this is your twin flame mir mirroring you. Flip it where it needs to go, please. Okay tell me more yeah someone here could have the chinese zodiac sign of a snake you might need to cut some cords baby okay saggy you might need to cut some cords right now and someone here who has the chinese zodiac sign of a horse you might need to cut some cords all right let me see yeah and there's someone here that's trying to form a group of people or of followers or of friends to create drama or negativity for you because they don't got a life or they their life sucks whatever let's get out big bertha and see what the heck is going on here holy spirit holy angels what the heck do we got what do we got someone's watching your pockets for show okay someone wants to know what you got in that bag what you got in that bag <laughs> holy spirit let me flip this over here. What do they need to hear right now? Yeah, someone here about a karmic cycle ending. Someone is freaking the hell out because they know karma's on its way. Something about this is of significance, a drive-by shooting, or someone wants to come by and drive. Someone wants to check your temperature, maybe. Or someone might actually get... Uh, someone's freaking out because they maybe they got involved in the wrong group of people. I don't know. Someone here... Um, something about your brother or something about your broski or your bro... Or someone's brother is of significance okay we have hid a child or a pregnancy from you so someone here could have hid this from you we have caring person someone here could be a very caring person we got wow the fuckery is real so maybe someone could have been out here saying that you were pregnant or lying or someone here lied and said they were pregnant when they weren't weren't pregnant in order to in order to hold on to someone yeah, or someone's pregnancy failed. Okay, something here about a miscarriage could be of significance. Is if this is you, my condolences. Okay, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, that's not good. Regardless if it's whatever, children are blessings. Tell me more, Spirit. We have just because God blessed you with the dingling doesn't mean you're the head of anything. So there's someone here that thinks they should be in charge of you, just because of the extra body part they got in the middle of their legs is what i'm getting the dangling kind all right this is the blind leading the blind it says a man that can't lead his own life but uh wants a submissive wife <clears throat> the cycle of you being with dominating 
or controlling people who don't have control over their own lives but want to have full control over yours, that cycle is ending. Regardless if you, I'm talking to a man or a woman, whatever this is, it's ending. Or you need to put an end to it because there's someone around you that could be displaying these types of behaviors and you need to say, bye. We have, it's not easy being the chosen one, but it's worth it. Keep going. Okay, we got 777. You guys could be seeing this number a lot. Okay, we have sex addiction. So there's someone here that could have a sex addiction here. This person could be very sassy. This person could be bisexual. Don't have to be, though. Someone definitely is out here telling people that you be doing black magic, though, because this card keep looking at me. Okay, but this is the same person using black magic to try to take you out, take you out this planet because they want to be you with this copycat energy. Some of you are going to have to testify against someone and, and speak your truth. Tell your truth in the court of law. Somebody lied on you in court. Someone here going to be crying like a bitch. Holy Spirit, holy angels. This person who lied on you could be 50 to 60 years old or you're 50 and 60 years old. We have it's all part of the plan. This is all divinely orchestrated by the divine. You guys can be seeing 1234 a lot or 123. We have my vibration is higher than yours sorry this is what you might have to say to this person because you have spiritually grown a lot whoever i'm speaking to especially if you're seeing 777 a lot bitch you got a lot of luck on your side we got bad business deals someone here made an agreement with someone a real bad terrible agreement we have pay attention to their undertone so there's someone here that's going to come talk to you you need to pay attention to their undertone yeah someone here is spreading a lot of rumors and lies about you all right, or they're coming in to get information to spread lies or rumors about you. So be careful about who you talk to, what shit you say, what information you give. Be cautious. Don't be paranoid. Don't be in fear. Just be a little, just be smart. All right, that's all. Think, think before you speak. Spirit, tell me more because these are trying times. Yeah, because these people are telling other people that you do black magic. This is what somebody be saying. Whoever this old ass... <laughs> let me calm down. <laughs> let me relax. This Someone could be saying this about you when you're, and you're up in age. Okay, let me just keep going. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, tell me more. This could be someone's mother-in-law or, or a father-in-law saying that you do black magic or something so that someone can't come towards you. We got a fake twin flame. So there's definitely a fake twin flame out here that's getting the ass whooped karmic cycle is complete with this fake twin flame gosh dang holy spirit holy angels what y'all doing out here because it's working what else they need to hear something about the month of october is significant your birthday could be in october or something significantly wrapped up in october this is beautiful or someone found out about a hidden child someone found out about a fucking pregnancy tell me more two 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 you guys can be seeing two 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 a lot you need to focus on what you want not what you don't want right now. Keep your mind very positive. We have checked the backyard. Are there something here right in your face? It's right in front of your face. Something here. Someone here. This even could be like a hidden enemy of y'all's. Tell me more. We have hometown friends are reaching out. Do not answer. So you might be expecting some sort of, or you might receive some sort of reach out from people you don't fucking talk to. Tell me more. <clears throat> Sorry that I'm cussing so much. Tell me more. You have poison. Someone here could have poisoned somebody in October or was paid to poison someone here in October to um, do this to them. Someone is, like I was saying, someone's trying to bankrupt you from your power, from your light, from your shine. They could have been trying to do this through this situation. I'm talking to a man or a woman. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, tell me more. Yeah, someone here is going to get in trouble for this planning or plotting or attempting to do something harmful to someone who this is part of the bad biz. Uh, la, la. This is part of the bad business deal someone was involved in. Someone thought they could get away with this, but they're not. Yeah, some sort of court ruled in your favor, spiritual or physical court ruled in your favor. You're about to find this out. It says the biggest lie ever told is it's not that simple, but truly it is that simple. I say this a lot to people during personal readings. Life is simple. Shit is really simple. We just... Confirmation. Thank you, God. 
It's just, we as humans, we complicate things with our fucking mind. Because our mind is complicated. It's a beautiful thing, but it's also could be a bad thing. Just like the internet. It's, it could, it's very helpful, but it could also do a lot of harm. But the internet's the internet. I love the internet. Anyways, let me keep going. <sighs> what else do they need to hear? We have money made off children. So for some of you, you're, you could have a karmic mother or a karmic father here that try to, is it going to come in and act like they're a caring person? Um, but truly they're trying to use you for something. Someone here is going to get, um, sentenced to life. They're going to be getting a life sentence here because of some sort of rumors and lies that they spread about you. Or someone here was trying to get you to have a life sentence because of some sort of rumors and lies that they told about you. Maybe someone could have said that you done black magic and that resulted in someone's death. Maybe someone here wanted to say that you were a murderer or that you were, uh, that's for some of you, not all y'all. So let's not get crazy in the comments. We got, um, private investigator is crooked. So there's a private investigator here that could have been hired from your fake twin flame to try to find you. Get ready, cause here I come. And this person's weird. This private investigator is weird. They could have been looking through your trash can. I could be talking to a Taurus, or this is a Taurus here that was trying to poison you, or there's a Taurus here that's a private investigator, or there's a Taurus here um, that was play that was uh, plotted on in order to get poisoned in October, or another Earth sign, or another Earth sign was trying to do this to another Earth sign, or whatever. We got Earth sign out here not being good. That's all I say. Or that's that's what I'm seeing. We got released private info about you to shoot to to hurt you. So there's someone here. There could be an earth sign out here that tried to release private info on you in in order to hurt you in some way, to block you in some in some way. But the this private info is rumors and lies. Okay, but someone was trying to pass it off as truth. This could have been a fellow earth sign. If you're all if you are an earth sign that I'm talking to, or this is just a fucking earth sign, chow. Someone here really, this person is sassy. I'm getting like someone here could be flamboyant, okay, in nature. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can you tell me more? Now, this could be someone's mama or brother or a duo, a mother and brother duo or a mother and daughter duo. For some of y'all, you need to know justice is on your side regardless of this dumb, dumb crap, crap, okay? Someone here is going to be throwing some sort of um, adult tantrum because they're not, things are not going to be ruling in their favor, so someone might come towards you, try to confront you, try to get you irate. Please remain calm. Stand firm in your beliefs and stand firm when it comes to your boundaries. All right. There's something here about a bank teller that feels guilty that is going to say something. Because we have inside, uh, Jesus, inside job, bank teller. All right. All right, all right, all right. Get ready, cause here I come. Let's get out um some of the shells, and then we're gonna wrap this up, cause my throat is hurting. My throat is hurting. Let me see, what do they need to hear? Let's do this, cause I didn't do these first. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. What can they expect in the near future? What's going on here? What do they need to hurt? I need to drink water. That's what I need. I need Wawa. Mm. Okay. What do they need to hear? Something here is going to... Uh, Something unexpectedly is happening to a lot of y'all. This is giving me miracle vibe. <laughs> For real. It says, wonderful things can happen in everything around you. It says, even from some of the most unexpected sources. All right? Unexpected. Something unexpected is happening. All right? And it's coming from someone talking a lot of shit. So, somebody's bad talk about you is actually going to bless you in some way and <laughs> this is kind of cool we got people are gossiping behind your back it would be wise to be careful with your actions right now bad rep enemy bad talk so you just got an enemy out here being weird of course the holy spirit holy angels tell me more it's okay you know you're in you're um i almost said you're impatient so maybe some of you are feeling impatient right now you need to 
relax, okay? Things are going to be okay, right? Things are not as they seem. Do not fall victim to the fear of the unknown that you're feeling, okay? We have imbalance. It says there is an unequal power dynamic in a situation that needs to be brought back to balance, okay? Um, it says unequal unfairness conflict. So there's someone here that thinks something is unfair, whatever this unexpected good shit that's coming towards you, okay? You need to know that you are protected or you need to protect yourself from this person that thinks that um, you're Marsha, 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 <laughs> okay? Marsha, 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 all right? It's because you're God's child. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, tell me more. My thing is, like, this person probably wasn't saying this eight years ago. We got good choices. It says, expect a positive outcome from the good choices you have made in the past. You're in alignment, whoever I'm speaking to. Okay. Um, I'm also getting, like, in the present moment, you guys could be experiencing, like, some sort of imbalance here. Let's figure out what this is. So we could just, you know, this is for some of you, not all y'all. Let me find out what it is. Here we are. What is this? What is this imbalance that we need to know about, Spirit? You know, and if it's, if this isn't you being imbalanced, this could just be like something here that you've been experiencing has been unfair for a very long time. Okay, this could be just like your family treating you unfairly for so long. Um, or you being in a relationship with someone who's been treating you unfairly for so long. This could even be a boss that you're dealing with that's been treating you unfairly for so long. Um, flip it where it needs to go. What, what's up with this imbalance? Yeah, okay. So for some of you, you guys need to dance. I know this sounds corny as fuck, but it's true. You need to dance. Okay? It says, I can move emotions through my body by dancing. It says, whenever I start to feel built up energy or crankiness i will play some music and move intuitively i don't have to look a certain way simply move and feel a feel as the stress or heaviness begins to ease out of my body so some of you need to really actively move your body right now it could be through dance it could be through exercise it could be through whatever but y'all really need to um move your body Okay, and there's someone here you need to let go. I keep saying that. Why do we have imbalance? Yeah. Ooh. It says, in order to change my life outside, I need to change inside. Once I am open to this change, my exterior reality will begin to mirror those new shifts. There's something here about a new shift in you. You could be intuitively feeling this new shift, but you, there's something here that you need to do in order to be part of or be in alignment with this shift. Something within, okay? That's for some of you, not all y'all, but whoever I'm speaking to knows what I'm talking about. We got loving friends here. It says, I surround myself with people who inspire me and grow together with me. My friends raise me up and hold me to the best that I can be. I am loved unconditionally and supported throughout my journey. I release old friendships which may be toxic or keeping me stagnant. So there could be old friendships out here or old relationships that you're holding on to. This can be family members, place where it needs to go. But the only reason you're holding on to them is because they've been in your life for so long. And for you, you may you can't picture maybe not having them be around or it's just like a time thing because they've been around i don't know something like that it needs to happen whoever i'm speaking to it's part of this is this is what this is what has to happen what else do they need to hear well let me do the higher selves first what does their higher selves need to hear it says, you are never lost, but only forging a path to new worlds. So like I was saying, you may be feeling like you're lost. Your fear, you may not know what's up ahead of you. And you may think like, oh, I don't know where I'm going. No, you know where you're going. You're exactly where you're meant to be. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. 
you're just you're you're not alone you're going down the same journey a lot of us have gone down already we have this is your time to step up and lead from your soul so answer to colin tell me more we have reach for your dream knowing that it's already coming true what is yours is already here believe that faith is all about believing in something you can't see it says you are a magical being with the whole universe waiting to assist you your ancestors your angels your spirit team god okay the universe whatever you want to put a name on it is waiting for you to ask for what you want they're waiting to help assist you but you have to make the the, the freaking first move baby you got to show that you're serious that that's this is for somebody okay okay i should probably end this because this is a way too freaking long this is a long one baby what else do they need to hear so we can wrap this up spirit let's just wrap it up wrap it up wrap it up what do they need to hear spirit regarding this situation i'm also feeling like someone keeps saying that they're a failure someone feels like they're a failure someone here is going to come in with a guilt trip with you i think so just be aware that what do they need to hear what do they need to hear we have ask archangel michael to help you with this situation we have archangel michael thank you for assisting me with blank it says please help me be filled with faith and peace at all times some of y'all need to open your mouths and start praying or you need to get on your knee like this and pray and then it says take your time making this decision okay it says archangel michael please help me stay strong and relaxed as i approach this situation remind me to detach and step back allowing the situation to naturally unfold thank you for protecting me tell me more spirit we have innocent whoever i'm speaking to you are being found innocent okay mm. It says, Dear God and angels, thank you for helping me see that all of your qualities of pure love and light are reflected within me and all others. Help me embrace my God-given innocence so that I may be at peace. Confirmation. And then we have, use your imagination and you'll see the answer says dear god thank you for granting me the wisdom and creativity to see my miracles in new and unexpected ways or to see your miracles in new and unexpected ways i'm telling you something's coming in you ain't see it coming all right it says i gracefully oh wait squeeze me i gratefully and gracefully accept and appreciate your help with this situation bam Listen, whoever I'm speaking to, you need to know something really good is coming in and you need to stop tripping, okay? Let's get some angel numbers and then we're going to bounce. What do they need to hear, spirit? We have 616. It says, be open to giving and receiving love. It says, a new partner or a reuniting of an existing relationship is eminent. So somebody might be coming from the past, good or bad. There's a lot of sixes. <laughs> says excessive worry and anxiety could be blocking your abundance or your manifestations it says focus on spirit and being of service at this time ciao don't worry you're gonna get gray hairs like me right here <laughs> yeah. holy spirit holy angels tell me more we have 909 it says take responsibility for your actions and your choices all right or someone here needs to someone you're dealing with we got organization and patience are critical at this time make a plan remain calm and jump in with hard work you will reach your goals whoever i'm speaking to you will reach them 
so don't trip baby 999 is everywhere it says live in your true potential or purpose okay this is gonna be the end of your reading don't forget to like comment share subscribe until next time i love you okay bye